If your clients are individuals and there is no need to group them, you can turn off companies. On the other hand, if you want to group your clients by company, you need to enable companies. This is useful if, for example, you want to send messages or share files to everyone in a company in a single step. In this video, we'll show you how to configure Copilot to support both scenarios. To disable companies, navigate to Settings, General. Here you can disable companies. You will no longer see the company column on the clients page when you do that. In addition, when you invite a client or a client opens the direct sign up link, they won't be asked for their company name. If your business serves companies, you'll want to enable companies. To do that, go back to settings and enable them. You'll see a company field if you check the client page now. This lets you assign a company to a client. Once a company entity is created, it can be assigned to multiple clients to group them together. This is useful because now you can send a message to a company instead of an individual client, and every client with the company is notified. Or you can share a file with a company so that all the clients associated with the company can access the files. When companies are enabled, there are two additional settings to understand. First, you can specify the default channel type. If you select Individual Client Channels, a new messaging and files channel is created anytime you create a new client, with or without a company. If you select Company Channels when you create a client with a company, a company messaging and files channel is created. If the company channels already exist, no new channels are created, and instead, the new client is added to the existing channels. The second setting lets you specify whether clients can invite colleagues to their team from the Settings Team page. When this happens, those clients are automatically assigned to the same company as a client user sending the invitation.